little road that goes off to the left of that last um, ski area, the top of the ski lift. And then it looks like it connects with this wash that continues on up and potentially I could go right up that wash or I could take a left and go along the right side of that rocky outcrop. So at this point, not sure exactly which direction I'm going to go. I'll get up to where I can see both um, approaches and see if I want to do the straight up approach or the to the left and then angle my way up and try to find the North Loop Trail approach. So here we go, continuing on up. By the way, um, the aspens are beautiful yellow, almost psychedelic, um, very beautiful looking. So gives you an idea where we are and just to give you a quick 360 degree view. There is Mummy Mountain and the north west side. And I don't know what this mountain is. I'm sure you can find it on a map, but um, it'll be a destination at some point. Although it looks like there's a little cliff climbing. Okay, onward. Well, what are the chances? Late September, no precipitation recently, and this wash has an active little stream and waterfall. Very beautiful when seen with the um, bright yellow background of the fall foliage here. And let's see if we can get a shot of Lee Peak. Well, there's the, um, the cliff ridge and uh, we need to get up to where we can, we decide whether we're going to go up the, uh, on the far side of this little rocky outcrop and maybe find an opening there or um, take the near side and, and try to find an opening. Doesn't look like there's much of an opening. <laughs> Um, straight ahead. Okay, onward. Well, there's the road I was on just a moment ago. Headed up the wash a ways, taking a sharp, well, sort of a sharp left, up this little wash. And I will be, well, it's hard to see with the sun immediately ahead, but I'm going to head up this wash and see where um, it can potentially connect and get me up to the top of that ridge up there. If not, I'll head back and we'll come back another day and try another route. Well, this is not a preferred route. I'm going straight into the sun. Can't see a thing ahead of me as I'm going up this little windy um, wash and it's wet. All the rocks are wet and a little slick. So what I'm going to do is go down and try um, scoping out another potential approach. And by the way, here's the 360 degree view and there's the main wash straight ahead down at the bottom there. So Okay, well, this is an exploring day. Okay, we're back on the main wash. And I could head up this main wash area, but as you can see, we're looking at a whole lot of debris. It's going to slow me down. 
So I am going to try another route, see if I can, and this doesn't really hit that ski lift tower that I saw on the upper north loop trail. So I'm going to try an entirely different route and see if I can connect um, going another direction and um, taking a less um, cumbersome trail. But the views here, there you can see Lee Peak and you can see the aspens and bright yellow. Um, views are beautiful here. So um, anyway, it's worth coming up to this point. And there we are looking down the main wash. I'm going to go back down to that waterfall and take a, a shot of, of the water cascading over the rocks for the, um, for the water page on the website. But anyway, yeah, this is an exploration day. And I understand that the winds are um, up to 50 mile an hour gusts up at uh, near the top of a La Madre, I mean not La Madre, um, up at the top of Lee Peak there. And so it may not be the best day to, to go all the way up, but I, I do want to explore the lower routes today. Okay, signing off. Okay, we're back down on the Bristlecone Pine Trail. And in retrospect, there's the Bristlecone Pine Trail. In retrospect, um, it looks like the ski lift tower to go for is the one that goes up that hill. And you can see a, um, a ski lift up there. Because that area up at the top of the ridge, just below the North Loop Trail, or just above the North Loop Trail, will connect with a ski area because there was a ski tower up there. And so it's got to be the ski lift there and then the area that I am shooting for is right behind this tree and you see the um, the high point up there and then there's lo what looks like a saddle and so I'm going to bet that what I need to do is head up that area and summit just to the left of that high point on the other side of the saddle and that is where I'm going to see the ski tower that I saw from above and that is going to take us up to the upper North Loop Trail but that's for another day so um, and then what I need to do is get past all the construction that's happening down here with all the do not pass this area so I may need to come up this far and then angle my way over to this ski lift over here and then through the the forest to the other ski lift to just stay above all the construction work and then I begin to follow old ski towers up to the top and I think that's going to be the solution. So there you have it. Lee Peak from Lee Canyon.